Freaky Nip Live. My name is Dinesh. We are watching season 14, episode 8 of South Park. It's called Poor and Stupid. Who's poor? Kenny. Who's stupid? Kenny. Because he, he, he always die. Sometimes it is his fault to die, you know? He's syphilis. You know, why didn't you use a condom, Kenny? You know that girl was a whore and she gives blow to anybody. So it was his fault. So poor and stupid is Kenny. Let's see what this episode is about. If you're not subscribed, please hit subscribe. And if you want to watch the full length reaction video of this episode and other movies and TV shows that I do, head on to my Patreon. It's a wonderful way to support the channel and you get early access to all of my videos over there. And now, let's start with this in three, two, one. Dude, you've been sitting at your locker crying since lunch break. Something's going they on. They killed his dad. It's just that, that essay that Garrison assigned us. What I want to be when I grow up? I don't like thinking about what I want to be when I grow up, alright? <laughs> what do you mean, you don't know? You're gonna be a conservative politician, of course. Why not? Because when I grow up, I want to be something that I know I can never be, Stan. <laughs> Hitler? <laughs> what? What do you want Carmen to be? Tell us. <laughs> what do you want to be? Hitler? I want to be a NASCAR driver, okay? Okay, yeah. See the car races on TV. So there's nothing wrong in that. Someone like me can be a NASCAR driver. What do you mean someone like you? You mean fat? Look at me. You really think someone like this can ever become an awesome, famous NASCAR driver? I mean, if you really want to be a NASCAR driver, you can work on it. You can work on yourself. NASCAR is only for poor and stupid people. Okay. I don't have what it takes. Okay. 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 <laughs> He's a fucking asshole. He's still a fucking asshole. I'm stupid enough to do NASCAR, and I never will be. Dude, I don't think just poor and stupid people like NASCAR. Exactly. Oh, really? Hey, hey, kitty. Hmm. You love NASCAR, huh? <laughs> <laughs> so, so what? <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. Leave him alone, guys. Leave him the fuck alone. I know you're trying to make me feel better, Kyle. But a rich, smart kid has no place on a racetrack. Fucking track. rich, Dude, smart. So <laughs> Thanks, Dan, but even if I was, I'd still be too rich. Okay. How are you rich? Your mom pays for everything. Exactly. You are poor. Oh, my God. You guys really think I could do this, don't you? Okay. <laughs> yes, they believe it. Yeah, of course. You're a broke, ignorant idiot. <laughs> Thank you so Thank much. You <laughs> I'm gonna go chase a dream. All right. At least it helps. You know, whatever motivates them. Who cares? Why butters? Butters. Hey, Hank. Butters. The guys have been talking to me, and well, they got me pretty pumped up. I'm psyched, butters. I'm about to do something big, and I'm psyched. Okay. <laughs> but I'm gonna need your help. Can you get psyched? You're gonna get yes, yes, but us, but us, I. He's such a great friend. <laughs> he matches your energy every time. I want you to take all my money. Oh shit! Every bit of it, butters. Fifty-eight dollars and thirty-two cents. That's all you have. You're giving away all your money. That is a rarity. Don't tell me where you spend it, and don't ever let me have it back. From this moment but on. But let's go. You deserve this, brothers. You fucking deserve this. After all this shit he's given you, you deserve everything. All the fifty-eight dollars. Nice shot. I'm gonna get as poor and stupid as I possibly can. All right, folks, How are you gonna be stupid? I mean, he is stupid. How are you gonna convince himself that he's stupid? <laughs> now, who's ready for Saturday's big race? I don't see any poor people here except Kenny. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it. Oh my god, he's so fucking pure, this guy. But uh, this world don't deserve you. This world doesn't deserve you at all, brothers. He's fucking too pure. What the fuck is he up to? <laughs> what is he watching upside down? You want to be stupid, yeah. I'm getting all the blood to rest in my head and watching a marathon of two and a half men. I used to love two and a half men and I was in college I used to watch it religiously. Uh, I loved it. And when Aston Ketcher came, I'm like, fuck this, it's gonna be bad. But it was actually better. And uh, now I see it again. I'm like, why the heck did I watch this show? <laughs> So fucking cheesy lines every time. Feel stupid yet? What? God damn it, another vagitail commercial? To stop feminine itching and relieve vaginal okay. odors. Fucking what? <laughs> <laughs> Please have stinky vaginas. Yes. Reaction, so your doctor. 
In some cases, badges still can lead to short-term memory loss. For the freshest, cleanest feminine area, do but, not... Short-term memory loss? Okay, what? But, Cartman, where are you going to use it? You don't have a vagina. Oh my god, Butters. We need Vagisil. Is he going to drink it from his mouth or from his back? I'm buying? Is I'm it? totally poor, Butters. Did you forget? But, but I, I, I didn't bring any money. I didn't know I had to buy Vagisil. God damn it, Butters. <laughs> right, just, 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 okay. <laughs> just gotta, yeah. Just steal it. Oh my god, he's just gonna eat it? What the f fuck? He is stupid. Already fucking stupid. In terms of this sort of stuff. Oh my god, this is fucking gross. It looks, no, it looks so bad. Oh my god, it looks so fucking bad. <laughs> the woman's like... What are you doing? Is getting the taste of Vagisil. <laughs> oh my god, I feel kind of stupid. You are. Yes, yes. I'm feeling totally stupid right now. You are. Yes. There we go. Let's get out of here. I'm ready. Come on, one accident and you'll be stupid in the NASCAR driver. <laughs> the Love the animation style. They got an upgrade in the animation. They're paying more to the animators now. What? <laughs> Oh my god. But, <laughs> that's one way to make him quit the race. That that is a way. If we would have said anything else, the guy wouldn't have believed <laughs> his wife's getting raped. <laughs> Don't my worry, Butters. I'm totally poor and stupid. <sighs> Ready for NASCAR. Does he know how to drive? I think you gotta push the gas pedal. What's that? There's like a long pedal on the floor by your right foot. Okay. Butters know better than you? <laughs> okay, now he's gonna kill himself. And then he's gonna kill other people. There we go. There we go. So many dead. So many fucking dead. Okay, there. Oh, fuck my ass. <laughs> of course. He'll be alive. He'll be still fucking alive. Hear it? <laughs> oh, that worked. <laughs> For this. All the effort I put in. You were still not poor and stupid enough yep. to win. Yep. Eric, you were as poor and stupid as you could be. Yeah, you did all everything stupid, Eric. He has two fractured ribs, a broken femur, torn ligaments in both knees, Damn, and a level right. two concussion. He also appears to be developing three small vaginas in his stomach, but what? they are all sparkling clean. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> they are all sparkling clean. You aren't on life support. <laughs> the bug wouldn't do anything. Donkey <laughs> You're lucky to be alive, young man. You have three vaginas, young man, or woman, or whoever you are. No, really. Of all the idiotic, dumb ways I've seen kids injure themselves, yours takes the retard. Kid. Oh my God! Thank you, doctor. <laughs> At least he was honest. You are really stupid. Could it be I only lost the race because I somehow wasn't poor enough? Okay. It has to be Eric. How are you going to be more poor now? Star on Fox 11 News. Are NASCAR fans stupid? <laughs> Some people are starting to wonder after a NASCAR <laughs> man apparently got high on Vagisil mm -hmm. and snuck onto the track killing 11 people. Oh, fuck it out. And he's still alive. He's out there in not going to jail. Nothing. He was later found to have ingested this maximum strength Vagisil and also Vagisil medicated wipes, making NASCAR fans look pretty stupid. <laughs> okay. You see what your friend is doing? The NASCAR fan vows he will try to do it again, but that this time he'll win. He'll kill all people. <laughs> He's fucking pissed off. He'll kill everybody now. Oh, don't kill Kenny. He's gonna kill Kenny, isn't he? <laughs> He's pissed off. <laughs> I realize what you poor people do. Buy things even though they don't have money by going out and purchasing things that are zero percent down and no pay for two years. That's how you people stay poor forever. Oh my God! Where's your mother, Eric? Where the fuck is your mother? Hey, I love NASCAR just as much as you do. Oh, it's so easy for you, isn't it, Kenny? Is 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 easy for him? It's easy for you, you fucking idiot. With a plastic spoon in my mouth. What? So <laughs> Kenny can't believe it. I didn't have parents to go do it for me like you do. Look, Why don't you change lives then? We shouldn't be fighting. We change lives. Can you gonna live here? You live with there. My name is Jeff Hamill. 
I'm the founder and CEO of Vagis. <laughs> okay. Uh, what are you doing man, here? Your NASCAR stunt has brought a lot of attention to Vagisil. Publicity? I don't know how to thank. There we go. A lot of money. They're finally realizing that their feminine odor can be treated. I mean, he has three vaginas and they're all super clean. She's my muse, my flame. We realize that NASCAR can do a lot for product recognition, and so Vagisil has a little present for you. A million dollars? Give it to Kenny. Oh shit, his own car. God damn. God fucking damn it. All right. You see, our thing just fucking work out for him. He just make me angry. <laughs> and he's gonna, I'm sure he's gonna make Kenny angry. <laughs> Kenny. Fuck off. Kenny, just shoot him. Yeah, we like to crack hips. There's one thing about Cartman. He's very much like uh, Trump in terms of he doesn't know how to get shit done, right? But he knows how to get attention and he knows how to make publicity and he knows how to bring more eyes to the thing. So it's very good for advertising of whatever show they're doing. You know, so that's why people like this sort of people. Com big companies like this sort of people. Excuse me, who is this driver? <laughs> you bring it on, Eric Hart. You scared the car, I'm just as poor and stupid as it's you. It's not poor. I'm going to drive and I'm going to go. It's definitely not a stupid. Can we just get back to the subject of racing, please? Hell, <laughs> bring it on, Danica. You dumb bitch. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm better than you. <laughs> <laughs> you seem really stupid, Eric. Thanks, B-Buds. 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 All right, what's up, NASCAR fans? I don't know about y'all, but this President Obama is pissing me off. <laughs> what did I say? When he grow up, uh, grows up, it's going to be a conservative. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a big There you go, publicity. Right. He needs that ad out. money. I found out that Obama wants to put a bigger tax on gasoline. <laughs> Is that what a conservative look like? Eating vagus seal? Fucking gay as hell. <laughs> y'all know my pet boss, buddy. Obama's fucking gay. Okay. He's fucking gay as hell. <laughs> so y'all just said to catch us in our next race. We're about as poor and stupid as a fucking cunt. So come down to the See, more publicity. NASCAR, NASCAR will love him. Hell. Okay. <laughs> we need that NASCAR really is just for the poor. And, the and don't forget, Obama is gay. Stage is set for what could be the most important race of the NASCAR year. Lots of speculation and interest. Oh, of course, <laughs> of course. People want people want him to crash. That's what people want. That's what people came here. First created Vagisil to try and help my wife, Patty. She's my muse, my flame. <laughs> okay, we know. Wherever Patty goes, her smile lights up the room. But. <laughs> Oh my god, it smells fishy in here. <laughs> Why did I? That was too much information. He didn't have to share that on live TV, also. Poor wife. Check your bag, please, sir. No, no, see, this won't do. Oh my god. You, bring a sniper rifle onto the track. <laughs> you need an automatic gun. It's, image. it's people like you that are giving NASCAR a bad name. Give him an AR. <laughs> you might be able to buy one in the gift shop. They just want to sell this stuff. <laughs> and how did Kenny put that big gun in there? <laughs> They're like, you can't bring your own gun. Buy it from our store. Yeah, get the brake lamp. I'm gonna hit the hit the brake. Oh my god. Oh god. The fuck are you doing? That is true. Oh god, she's gonna die. Oh son of a bitch! Get out of there. Drivers are not going to be happy about this. Of course. Think, He's happy. His car's winning. Is a company that okay. really stands behind its product, Chris. We want women to know that Vagisil is effective, safe for use every day. Have you heard about his every wife? Every day. Every <laughs> day. Wife, you're still stinking? What are you doing? He made this product for you. You need to use it. The thing about... Winning from other people, if you can't win from them, don't don't let them go forward. Oh my god, he's gonna! Oh my god, oh my god, that he was that fucking intentional. <laughs> no, she didn't. Danica Patrick is dead. 
That's what people, oh my God, that's what people in my school did sometimes, you know. If they can't pass the exam, they will try to make other people fail. Oh, well, oh my God, so many people dead. Kenny, where's your shotgun? A sniper rifle. Oh my god, damn, he is pissed off though. What the? Kenny, what the hell are you doing? Kenny, he hit brake, you're gone. You're the car, Kenny. <laughs> and they're gone. Oh my, oh my god. He need to be in jail. He need to be in fucking jail. He was born with a plastic spoon. Yeah, gone. And Kenny's dead. Oh God! Oh, oh geez, God! There's a little boy on the track. <sighs> well, it appears that all the other drivers have crashed, and only the Vagisil car remains. What did I say? If you can't win, destroy others, and then you win. Feminine odor must be treated diligently. Are you listening to my wife? She's gone. <laughs> Patty's gone. Patty's like, fuck you. Fuck you, I'm gone. <laughs> Patty, Patty, what the it fuck are you doing? Like a woman is trying to take over for Jimmy Johnson's car. What? Yeah, damn, Patty's gonna win this race. Patty's like, fuck Vagisil. Let's go. You are on an active race track. This fuck is you. Dangerous. Let me talk to her. Patty. Patty, what are you doing? Patty, I'm not taking your bullshit anymore. That's what I'm doing. Know how you get when you don't use your Vagisil. There should be some in your purse, my muse. My muse. My flame. Let's go, Patty. Kill this fucking... Butter, this bitch is trying to wreck my car. Hang up. That bitch in the That's so gay. Fucking gay in hell. Fucking gay as hell. Patty, you are my muse and my flame. Let's go, Patty! There we go! There goes Vagisil. Please blow up! He didn't blow up. Patty fucked Vagisil, that's for sure. Let's go, Patty! Let's go! As long as. How could you? You've ruined us! You've ruined Vagisil! Punch him. No, no, Kenny, go ahead. I deserve it. I thought I could just waltz onto a racetrack and do what these people do. Dude, you kill so many people. The truth is, I'm just too smart. Oh and with how smart I am, I'll always be successful and therefore have money. I just have to accept that. So I'm fucking stupid. All right, Butters, give me back my money. Huh? What? The $58.32 I gave you. I want it's it back. It's gone. But, but you, you said I had got to spend on it. On the, but I can't even die. But, but now I took it back. But you, <laughs> yeah, Butters, you better have it. Butters, you're always trying to screw me over. Oh, fuck off, you always tried to screw butter over and he only did was to help other people. Fuck it up. That was poor and stupid. I mean, people want Hartman to quit and then he does quit. The thing is, he thinks that he is doing the right thing for, for other people. That's why he's quitting. Fuck off. I mean, he is doing the right thing. Other people are not going to die. But he thinks that he is the bigger one in this one. You know, he doesn't listen to other people. That's what people make people other people angry because they're like, we didn't get to have over say. He just fucking act stupid, and then things things just work out for him. And talking about how you can win a race, there were some kids in my college who would who if they don't know the exam properly or if they don't if they think that they're not gonna pass the exam, what they tried to do was uh, distract other kids a night before so that their exam also don't go well. So it was just like Cartman, you know, fucking that stupid. Because if you, don't, if you can't win, just kill other people and then you win. But I love Patty, you know, Patty with the clutch. She comes and then wins the race, got her trophy. And I'm sure she's smelling fresh as ever. Hopefully, no fishy smell, please, Patty. And I think people just think that the NASCAR fans are stupid because they only come there to see other people die or something to crash. I'm sure they're not going there to be like, yeah, this car is winning. Most of them are going there. Let's see who's going to flip today. Whose car is going to flip? Whose car is going to burn down? And who's going to kill, kill people? So that's why I think they have a reputation of poor and stupid. But uh, who knows? Who fucking knows? But yeah, that was it for today, guys. Hope you all have a great day. If you're not subscribed, hit subscribe and like this video. Share, comment down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.